Say pull out the squad You know what we on Tryna get the drums Sticking like a charms Cutting all the cars So you know what I'm on So we on the way What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel Shout out to Guy King Happy you said I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong um, he asked me if I can, is there a trick on how to make 808 patterns or like how to make 808, something like that. I forgot what it is, but I'm going to show y'all. Um, for those who don't know what 808s are, you ever listen to a song and you hear that, that boom, boom, like what make your speakers move? That's what's called 808s and which, it basically gives the song movement, basically like. Without 808s, the song wouldn't be, the song wouldn't be, you know, you can't, you can't really dance to so, it. Not saying that you need a, every song needs 808s because that's not the case, but that's, that's what I'm saying. Um, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show y'all how I make my 808s or what 808s I use in Logic, and then I'll give you like two or three different 808 patterns you could do. 808, 808 patterns you can use just to start out. It's, it's really simple, um, but I'm going to show you anyway, and hopefully this helps. Okay. Okay, so I do most of my, all of my production, actually, in Logic. So, um, I'm going to show you first what, because I actually use, if I don't use a um, stock base, I actually use um, either a 808 from a kit, or I can show you how to make your own actually in Logic with a, within a plugin. So first, let me show you track base. Kind of put um, this EQ on it. I have a preset for it. So basically, I'm cutting out all the high ends right here, and then I kind of cut all the frequencies. Um, I think it's under, yeah, all the all the sync all the frequencies below 30, and then I raise it up in between the 30 and the 200, and then I kind of give it this. And then, if you want like that crunchy um, type, um, I wouldn't use a big crusher. I would actually go to distortion and yeah. So that's an option. Um, let me make another track. And if you want to actually like make your own 808s, you can go to um, this thing called ES2, Synthesizer 2. And um, I actually already have it made, but I'm actually just um, show y'all how to do it from jump. Okay, so make sure this is on um, wave um, wave wavelength. And then um, you're gonna bring your drive up. Bring your what oh, distortion is already cool. Bring it up some more. And then you're gonna bring your um, bring this down. Bring your attack up a little bit. And then bring your um, up a little bit. And then, application so um do the 808 cut all the highs and then and um yeah you can do that um you could basically 
just continue to do that until you find your own 808 that you personally like from a kid or you can make your own it really doesn't matter dude like i mean you have various different options when it comes to your music um but let me just um you want to see a pattern so i'm going to do it in c i actually like that as an 808 though I didn't even save it. Let's go to it. So basically your patterns basically differ depending on what kind of vibe you're trying to go with for the song, um, what kind of movement you want, like, you know, it, it really depends on the producer, honestly. But, um, let me just do a little fog on loop so you can see. Um, oh, no, I didn't mess up on it. helpful um maybe you could make your own 808s and change up the uh 808 patterns every now and then whatever you want it's basically about what you feel comfortable with and you don't have to do no crazy 808 slides now because it took I, i'm still working on my slides so i mean i'm still working as a producer in general so you gotta start somewhere in order to get to where you want to be it's not going to happen overnight. It's not going to happen. It's practice, just like everything else. So, I mean, mess around with it. Play around with it. Um, eventually, you'll find a pattern that you really like, and you'll build from that. So, hopefully, I helped you and everyone else that was curious about this. Um, thank y'all. Hit that subscribe button. Press that like button. Come join the gang. Come join the family. Come join the squad. Y'all have a blessed day. Have a great day. See y'all at the next one. Peace.